Cage Warriors 43 emanated from the HMV Forum in London, England, live on the Fight Network Saturday night. Middleweights took center stage in the night's main event as Ultimate Fighter 11 cast member Jack Mason battled Norman Parese. The first two rounds saw the Tsunami Gym product try and take this fight to the canvas, but Parese showed impressive takedown defense. In the third, Parese exploded with a flying knee, smelled blood, and went in for the kill to end the fight. And Jack Mason doesn't know what has hit him. I think he's speechless, Mr. Ian I'm, I'm starting to know. The Battle of Ireland served as the night's co-feature as Ultimate Fighter 12 cast off Joseph Duffy was paired with fellow countryman Francis Heagley. Both fighters attempted a number of submissions with Duffy threatening with the Kimura on both sides in the first and Heagley with what looked like a fight ending guillotine choke in the second round. Going into the third this fight was anyone's for the taking but Duffy appeared fresher and landed more shots which was enough to take home the unanimous decision. After a controversial disqualification in their first encounter, Brad Wheeler looked for redemption in his 155 pound rematch with Ian Entwistle. The team bloodline pupil immediately got this fight into the clinch where he landed some effective elbows and short punches causing the English fighter to shoot for the takedown. It was here where Wheeler took advantage, sinking a back mount triangle choke, causing the previously undefeated fighter to tap just 3 minutes and 22 seconds into the first. Lovely Jiu Jitsu from Brad Wheeler as we see the Tito Ortiz style grave digger. I think he is rightly incredibly happy with his performance. Six foot ten English juggernaut Dave Keeley faced off against Dean Litzer blue belt Andreas Karoantakis in a heavyweight matchup. The 29 year old German was dominant from the opening bell avoiding a number of submission attempts from his foe on the ground and would shortly after sink in his own armbar to end the fight. And wow that was opportunistic grappling at its best from the German. In the night's opening bout, Brent Sizeland earned a first round submission over Craig White landing a rear naked choke just 4 minutes and 15 seconds into the opening stanza. He gets the tap nonetheless, a fairly strong fight for Brent Sizeland.